M0FXB, welcome to my channel. So we're using my RTL SDR.com dongle. And we're on uh, my favorite one, really, which is HDSDR. And I'll put a link in the description where you can download and install this. It's very straightforward. So this video is just about how do you set the squelch. I know it sounds really simple. So let's go to an active signal here. We'll double click here. Right, and wait for someone to transmit would be nice. So you can see the signals here. Now we've got the squ set squelch set quite high. Now look here on the left where the meter is. See the way there's a, a red section here. Now we could push that to the very bottom just by clicking it with our mouse. Or we could go up, click above the signal. And look, and then now the squelch threshold is a lot higher. So we'll click that. We can't hear that station there. We've clicked on there. Now let's lower the squelch. There you are. You can hear something now. Let's see if we can tune in a bit better. Side then. Let's try here. We could use the actual frequencies here to change frequency as well. All sorts of settings here. But this one is just to show you how to change the squelch, which is look, watch. Silence. And then we could, our RF gain is very high here, isn't it? So let's lower that a bit. Now we've got so much noise interference here. Look, we've got nine signal interference, or 20. So that's a bit bad. There's a lot of uh, LEDs in this, in the, around this house. We need to just turn them all off. One thing I want to mention there you to go. Uh, uh, Chris was he's on. So the cobweb, I think you'll find that. Sounds okay, then not it? And then the do the squelch above, uh, you'll hear nothing. Do the squelch below, as well. you hear it. There you are. How do you set the squelch on HD SDR seven three? Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe my channel. All the best.